guys, it's week two of January and I've already given up on being a vegan, as you can see. <laughs> but what we're not giving up on is the fashion game. And the Glamours had another great week. We had a great week in fashion, as Tamara said. On Monday, we started with a bit more of an edgy look with this patent leather blouse, uh, uh, skirt. And we paired it with this blush blouse by Dolce & Gabbana to soften up the look. I love it. So, okay, we hear you, as they say, we hear your comments about fashion and what you like and don't like. Controversy. My mother loves this blouse, loved it. Asked me where it was from. I said, from a place we can't afford. <laughs> it's Dolce & Gabbana. Yeah. My cousin Erica Hall did not like this look. Right. She didn't like the shoes. She didn't like the look. And I don't know why. I thought it was very pretty. You paired it with these Pierre Hardy strappy shoes. And that was a last minute decision. Right. Because we weren't sure of the shoe. Mm -hmm. The earrings are spectacular. Rose gold from Dazzle. From Rose Dazzle. Rose beautiful. gold from Dazzle, yeah. This was a great look at it. Uh, the colors were beautiful. Mm -hmm. It just shows you some people react to different yeah, things. Yeah, but things. we don't take it personally because that's the thing about fashion is like art. You know, it's like, it speaks to you as it does. I loved it. It was the Oprah Winfrey show. It was my big interview with Oprah. And I really wanted to wear something that was soft and that's how I felt. I was feeling all mushy inside. And so that top I thought captured, but I also tried to lead with strength. And I thought that skirt was a very strong skirt. All right. I, I loved it. This is straight Michael Jackson yeah. smooth criminal. <laughs> when I saw this, I was like, this is Michael Jackson smooth criminal. Tell me about it. It's, uh, it's from Michael Kors from Resort 2020 collection. Uh, it's a kind of a nod to the 70s disco, mm -hmm. uh, disco era actually. Um, a double bracelet jacket with a matching pant and the crystal pinstripe. And the crystals make the outfit very heavy. It's a weighty yeah. outfit, which is why I was happy you paired it with a weighty shoe. We did it with a platform. I actually can tell so you. So we did it. these navy satin Oscar de la Renta platform shoes going with the 70s vibe. Right. Very nice. And this, Eric? This one was from Wednesday. It was one of my favorites actually also. Uh, the top is a silk organza top by Michael Kors. Beautiful. And we paired that. We actually had a pink skirt with this first, but then last minute it? we oops, we changed it to the uh, Dolce Gabbana lace skirt, which is actually a great combination of texture and a pattern. And that's smart. And again, my mother asked me for where that <laughs> But we've been sitting on this green skirt for a long time yeah. because Eric wanted um, a top that really spoke to it. And that's your point, but the mix and texture. Right, exactly. And, so, and that's what I love about working with you, Tamara. You, like, you are very oh, adventurous. And added, the shoe? Yeah, we added more texture with velvet. So we did the navy blue. As Eric likes to say, that's an Alaya shoe from my own collection. <laughs> right. That's what her own closet. So you had a, blue. a velvet blue shoe, mm -hmm. a green lace textured skirt with a polka dot chiffon silk um, top. It's I love like, it. And that's the difference in wearing a clothing, or wearing clothes and styling it. Yeah. That's right. what they do. That's a styling. Right. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people say don't mix blues with greens, uh, mm -hmm. but it just shows you all yeah. those rules. It's, not really bad. I right. love this dress. This dress uh, is so beautiful. And it was an elastic waistband, pattern dress, and this dress is $35, Woo! ladies. Uh, this is dresses from Zara, mm -hmm. um, and we paired it with a Sarah Rocco belt, belt, like a ribbon belt. Uh, it just shows you it's like how you wear it, how you style it, because Ashley can tell you what was the yeah, shoe we, we did put this with it. embossed metallic right out of Tamara's closet, Tom Ford. Those shoes are like five years old. You know what? I saw Taraji P. Henson in those shoes about five years ago. I forget what movie she was promoting. And I asked her where the, when she told me and I stalked it and found it. <laughs> but I do like that because this is a time of the year where a lot of fashion stores like Saks, they, they are about to move out all the inventory. Right. So it's marked down. Yeah. Even at the stores like Zara, this is when, so we found that in the bin right. for $35. 35 right. So this is yeah. when you now go in and get all the stuff you want. Um, and this was our grand look because it's a big show. Tyler Perry, Cecily Tyson, Felicia Rashad. I had no idea that they would be wearing red. And we just coincidentally, <laughs> wore this red dress. Yeah, this was another beautiful one. It's a designer, David Coma. He's based out of uh, London. He's known for his sculptural uh, designs. Like a, he has a built-in corset. I love the high slip. Now, because it's such a, a high slip, <laughs> slip, <laughs> whatever, and it's a little busty, you paired it, the shoes are more demure. Yeah, so we went yeah. classic with this satin leather sling back, and then we have the shoe. hint of the same color in the shoe. So it I love very that nicely. Shoe. And we put another little crystal, and then a crystal hoop, hoop yeah. with it. Because the dress was so strong. Yeah. That's, I love that. So the dress is strong, so you did mirror the hoop. Well, it was a spectacular week. Yeah. I loved each and every look, and I love more important than just the range, how you can just play with it. Right. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Yay. Back to my vegan diet. Pretty much a vegan. <laughs> <Are they? laughs>